know the story behind the tree. When my sister got killed, my father went out and bought this. It was just a little tiny tree. It had a ball on it. We used it as our first Christmas tree that year because he wasn't in the mood to go up to the attic and pull out all the trimmings and whatnot. So, and then it grew into this beautiful tree. And now we're going to be doing the lawn. Big. It's too big. And Scott came up with actually the idea of cutting off the top of the tree and uh, using it as a Christmas tree. So once again, we get to use it. But not to be all sentimental. But I was thinking about the tree a lot today. It was funny because I woke up this morning <coughs> and Heidi left the room and I kind of stared at the tree and it was really weird knowing that we were going to take that tree down today. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. But, and then, not to refer it to life, but, <laughs> but, <laughs> but all of Well, you're in the mall. Yeah, but, but it's true that. because, you know, you wake up every morning and you don't know what your day is going to hold. You know, and the world is crazy and things are going on in this world that we don't know, we can't predict. And it's awesome to have family and you guys, and, you know, I'm glad that we're close and our friends are close and it's really awesome. Just like my sister got up that day and she didn't know that was going to be an or pop last year. We didn't know this was going to be the end. Um, our days are numbered, but I don't think taking the tree down is the ending of something i think it's the beginning of something beautiful you know it's our family and we're just going to be moving on and it's awesome i'm glad the tree's getting a second chance so anyway the rebirth is the huh the rebirth is the it is the rebirth it's the whole the whole the circle of life anyway you want to help me cut this down <laughs> just don't <laughs> drop it on the house please huh <coughs> you have no faith you have no faith your foot hurts uh, so much yes yeah. I mean, if you cut it, then wait, wait. Should I put a rope on it or not? Why would you even chance it? <laughs> yeah, just watch it go right, right to the kitchen. My thing is, where's this dog? So the dog is out. Oh, Chris, is everybody? Bam. Did you say put a rope on it? Oh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> Trust me. Have faith. Yo, have faith. Oh. <laughs> no. Side? Yeah. Shouldn't you cut it from the other side? No. What it's doing is it's... It doesn't. 